He's reloading. He's gonna peek in three, two. What's up, guys, and welcome back to another video on the channel. These are going to be my first impressions of Valorant, and you may ask, you know, why would you like to know my first impression of everybody else's? Uh, Battlefront 2 is pretty similar to Valorant in the way that you use abilities. Hence, I'm going to break down what I think of the game and how I think I will see what's going to happen in the future. Don't get me wrong, I'm no shroud when it comes to games. I can't adapt to them very easily. However, I've been playing similar shooters such as Overwatch. So, you know, I think your boys got this. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'm also going to include some gameplay towards the end, as I did at the start of my clips. I had a really fun time on this game, and I hope you guys do enjoy it. You know, we'll start off with the main question, probably why you're watching this video right now, as to why you're watching all other Valorant videos as well, is to gain your own perception as to why this game was overhyped and does it meet the demand. No, you got some big terms in this. Right, so if you guys didn't know, this company is produced by Riot Games that is owned by Tencent. That is the world's largest gaming company. I'm pretty sure to my knowledge, they own quite a lot of stuff in China. And that's where their main video game source comes from. If you guys don't know League of Legends already, I'm quite familiar with it. I've been playing every season since season four. And that's what spiked my interest already because I knew Riot Games was a dev team I could stand behind and I knew they could balance a game enough so that it works, you know. So one of their main objectives here and what they promised was 128 tick servers as well as a great netcode to go with it. And they really emphasized how good the anti-cheat was going to be. Now this is a problem I think every single FPS competitive game has from Counter-Strike to Overwatch to even Battlefront 2. It has a huge hacker problem and it isn't even competitive. It's something I stress so much in my time in my experience when I'm playing video games because I put time and effort into my games just for someone to pay about five dollars and absolutely destroy me and decrease my experience of the game. Now if you guys were thinking why did I mention CSGO and Overwatch as the competitive games that were similar to it I feel like this game is trying to make sure that they will give us those features such as the tick rate and the netcode and the anti-cheat at the dispense of things like graphics. I feel like graphics aren't that big of a deal in 2020, especially when the gameplay is there and the personal experience is also there. We realized that with Fortnite as well. Fortnite got recently huge, even though its graphics weren't the best and it was produced by Epic Games, which wasn't the biggest company. It was in a triple A team behind it. And that just proves to show having the best graphics or the best engine doesn't amount to your personal experience when you're going to play it. Now, I might sound pretty biased when I speak about this game just because I have been enjoying the game recently and it's something I would recommend you would pick up even if it's just a new experience. It's something on the lines of CSGO with abilities and those abilities really just change up everything and it makes it so that you can't just be good at aiming and reaction time it isn't just down to that. It's about how you utilize your t utility as well and how you play around different characters. You can also do nasty combos like I was against the Sage that slow owed me and I got absolutely rolled by a grenade subsequently after and i'm pretty sure there are the nuts combos as well that just haven't been figured out yet now the map design is pretty good except for this one map i think i have no idea what it's called but there's one map that's super ct sided and i feel like that needs to get changed but i don't really think that's a problem with riot especially since they can rework their maps that's another good thing about the graphics and design i feel like it can be updated very easily that was something that was also initially a problem with Siege as well. In the early maps, you might have noticed a lot of maps have been reworked in Siege. I think the most recent has been Border, even though it's sometimes only just a visual upgrade. There has been upgrades to the angles as well. And that's just mainly because for map balance, it really goes far when one side gets a CT at the start and they're defending. And all they need to do is hold angles and they'll gain like a 12 round lead and the game will be over and the momentum wouldn't have shifted the entire time. Map changes go a long way and it keeps everybody on their toes as to what angles to watch. And I feel like that's something Battlefront couldn't do, especially with us getting Geonosis after a year from release. And that's really what held us back, the uh, Frostbite engine. I've noticed that the devs consistently make bugs when they touch coding and I feel like that isn't a healthy environment to be around where you're developing a AAA game that you're too scared to touch or too scared to change majorly without breaking a handful of things. I know the UI has been updated several times in the past few months and the hit marker bug is still there where you don't receive hit markers sometimes. Alright, that's enough about fun for the uh, Valorant first impression. However, I am going to be continually uploading for this game. I think. I am enjoying it quite a lot right now in the closed beta. We'll see what happens later on. But for now, I'll show you guys some sick clips and I hope you guys will be intrigued and will stay around for the content later. Shout out to my boy Baruga. He did feature in some of these clips. You can find him over at twitch.tv forward slash Baruga and me at S4GE. That's only if you're interested though. You know, you don't have to. But I hope you guys like the content and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Oh shit, what are you doing, huh? Oh
<laughs> okay, they're trash. <laughs> they are so trash. They are so trash. <laughs> Bro, I'm up here. See if you can bail. Assume I'm super low. Oh my lord. These fucking grenades, man. Holy right. shit. It's so sad. Yeah, yeah they were A again. They were A again. Look sharp. They fucking love A. Damn. Good job. Hans shot. Careful now. Alright, this is how we did it, Baruga. We fucking yunked that shit. We gotta take the initiative, bro. I'm smoking that shit again. I'm pressing E and I'm pushing. I got slow orb as well. So we can trap them in. Yeah, yeah. Push them. It's easy. Yeah, yeah. It's free real estate. The gaming god. Oh, I got grenaded. Oh. He's in there. The pre fire, baby. I'm letting you rip. Oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Fucking. Oh my god, I'm done. Oh, we trash. <laughs> oh, I whiffed my shot too, so man. bad. Okay, I'm smoking it again. I'm trying to learn my smoke here. I'm gonna slow them. I'm gonna slow them. Beautiful. I hear them. They're, they're like sc ever at rats scurrying, dude. Shoot that shit. Alright boys, I'm one off my ult. Homies are dying behind us, dude. Hold, hold that, hold on. I'm checking mine. No, I'm checking mine. No, hold it, hold it, hold it. Behind us, come on, come on. I got you. My dish shot, bro. Hold me for a little brother. I'm so scared. trash! He's on the bomb. Fuck. Enemy removed. I can, I can res you. Enemy down. I got a big play coming up. Take it if you want. Right in there. Wall race. Big play coming up, baby. Massive. Cool. You got 30 seconds. Can't be wasting 30 time. 30 seconds left. Fuck! We're playing against the timer, baby. They know I'm coming here, but fuck it, I'm gonna beat them in aim. We have to. We have to push it. Grab it, grab it, grab it. I'm running! Cover me, Baruga! Ten seconds. Run it! Oh, they're, they're in so heaven, 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 heaven! One enemy remaining. One down. Oh, shit! Headshot. Light planted. Let's go! Shit. Let's go! Oh. We're not. This game is so fucking easy, dude. Be fast. Mm -hmm. uh. So he can't hear you. Oh shit! Uh. Jesus! Come on, let's go! Uh. On super low. I hit her. He's going down. Oh, you ain't coming back. Nice. A fucking pistol and I killed you guys. She's on top of this box. One enemy box. remaining. Oh, come on, every shot. Got their hit fire. Hit yeah. every shot. People hit fire only and kill you all the time. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, high. Heaven, heaven, heaven. One enemy remaining. Yeah, USP is a stun pistol. That's going on the highlight reel for sure. That's not going on the highlight reel. There's no highlight reel there, my dude. <laughs> You're fucking doing it. I'm CT. CT on Oh, CT. we should not lose that. Just waiting for you guys to push in. 
Also, I can barely hear what this guy is saying. He's just mumbling 98% yeah, yeah. of the time, so I'm just like blocking it. One was seating and one was on the bottom. 30 seconds left. Corner. To your left. One enemy remaining. Heads up. Prepare for hellfire. Ten seconds left. Oh, Fucking out, dude. That's close, close, close. Sure. I was playing, I was playing, I was playing mind games inside of his yeah, mind games, close. you know. Eyes up. Mm -hmm. I didn't know if you okay, know.